LAS Vegas, President Donald Trump has condemned the Las Vegas concert shooting, which has now become the deadliest mass shooting in modern American history. At least 58 people died and another 515 were wounded when a gunman opened fire onto the crowd during a country music festival. Speaking from the White House Monday, Trump called the massacre an act of pure evil. He praised first responders and police on scene for their bravery at the tragic scene. The speed with which they acted is miraculous, and prevented further loss of life, the president said. To have found the shooter so quickly after the first shots were fired is something for which we will always be thankful and grateful. The president has ordered all American flags across the country to be flown at half-staff until sunset on October 6 in honor of the victims of Las Vegas. In his remarks, Trump said that he will visit Las Vegas on Wednesday. In moments of tragedy and horror, America comes together as one. And it always has, Trump said. Our unity cannot be shattered by evil and our bonds cannot be broken by violence. Trump says he and First Lady Melania Trump are praying for the entire nation to find unity and peace. My warmest condolences and sympathies to the victims and families of the terrible Las Vegas shooting. God bless you, Donald J. Trump at Real Donald Trump October 2, 2017 In a tweet, Mrs. Trump said that her heart and prayers goes out to victims, families, loved ones. In a series of tweets, Vice President Mike Pence said he and his wife were praying for the victims and that the hearts and prayers of the American people are with you. Pence also thanked the first responders for the acts of bravery in the moments after the shooting. To victims, families, loved ones affected by this senseless violence in Las Vegas, Karen and I are praying for you offering our love, Vice President Pence at VP October 2, 2017, the heart's prayers of the American people are with you. You have our condolences and sympathies, Vice President Pence at VP October 2, 2017 to the courageous first responders, thank you for your acts of bravery, Vice President Pence at VP October 2, 2017.